God. He is not capable of being unjust. He's not capable of what? Forgetfulness. God will never forget your labor. But this is what the scripture said. He said he's not capable of forgetting your labor of what? Is your labor of love he doesn't forget. Your labor of escapades, they are no longer there. The reason why they are holding you down is because you feel they are there. They are like bones and sockets in your mind. That the reason why this thing is happening to me now is because I did this party two years ago. I remember when Satan said to me that I'm not going to have children. I accepted. And that was because I didn't have a level of knowledge in God. I accepted. In fact, one of the first audible voice I heard in my life was the cry of a baby. And Satan said, that's it. They are the ones. So they are crying a voice of condemnation against you. I said, so with this one, you won't have kids. And I said, so be it. I accept. But there is something here. He said, God is not unjust to forget your work and labor of love which you have shown towards his name. Your labor of love towards his name, towards his person, outwit any other labor that you, you've been on before you came to him. Your labor of love, now that you've come to the Lord, outweighs every of your past. In fact, it's more daring, for God is not unjust. So, God is not capable of being unjust. You know the Bible says, truth is falling on the street. There's no longer caution. So, but God, he's on his own altar. There's no unjust scale with God. So sometimes, Pastor Grace, there are labors we are on now that we may not come into the harvest. The people that we come into the harvest will be OVA, EVA, and other people. That's why we must be very careful of our labors. There are certain labors you put on ground now. If you show unjust skills and you demonstrate it in your leadership, don't worry. There is a season of visitation. So in your walk with him, in your being planted in him, there is one thing he is not capable of. He is not unjust to forget your walk. Please let me tell your neighbor with God, there is no forgetfulness.